So we're, we're continuing off of where we were last time. Yeah, what the hell did we leave off? Oh, I, yeah. I think we left off doing nothing whatsoever. Uh, I think we were actually doing some progress. This, this woman looks like a prostitute. Let's talk to her. <laughs> the last time, too. <laughs> I immediately recognize her. It's the same thing. What is this place? Oh, a new face. Uh, I'm, the, I'm the fucking prostitute? Yeah? Yeah, I was the guy before. All right. Yeah, uh, Brian, we've already established long ago you were a fucking whore. Ah, new face. You are, you're in Moonlight Hotel. That's you, Boo. Oh, I guess I'm this guy I now. I called you Boo. <laughs> oh, shit. I punched the pop filter. Oh, God. Okay, we punch it all the time. I don't think there's one recording where we haven't hit the mic in some way. Last recording? I'll throw, it, I'll throw in a hit. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Uh, doesn't look like a motel to me anymore. You know what? I think it's because the beard uh, that we always give him that type of voice. Uh, yeah. <laughs> if, he, if he didn't have the voice, I feel like he'd have the beard. I mean, he Who would have a baby, ba a baby face. Who are you and all these people? My name is Alice, and these people, well, it wouldn't make sense for me to li list names, right? Good boy. I'm still trying to figure out where the hell I am. You're not alone there, it's like an endless loop. A loop? You won't crack. <laughs> we have been stuck here for this infinity of any, or so it feels. But this place is not happy when you make the decision to stay. Uh, don't tell me you want to leave. Oh wait. <laughs> <laughs> don't you want to leave? <laughs> don't tell me. <laughs> well, some of us tried to leave once, but the only way out is through the riddle. Oh shit, we're fucked. Uh, it's we're a puzzle. It's really bad. So we worked together to try and solve the riddle. There were too many of us. People turned against each other. Cannibalism oh, struck. Wow. Uh, I mean, there was one point where a man literally just started eating another man. He didn't even cook him. I feel like that just keeps right out once. <laughs> oh, I'm, oh, yes, I've gone insane. I mean, Time to I, eat I everyone. Mean, I'm down if you are. I mean, we got a knife. We got a person behind us. Like I said, like I said, cannibals have come out and said that like, humans taste like pig. Why do you <laughs> want to be bad? We had like bacon pig. That's true. They don't even hate to be a cannibal. <laughs> Kill the outsider. <laughs> you won't like bacon? <laughs> oh, man, it's me. We decide to put it all and try to get along. Things are better now. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm not sure I followed. Also, I'm from Texas now. Hey. <laughs> you really changed the personality. Damn actually. right I did. <laughs> ah, silly me. Let me explain. When we first arrived, a man with a red tie and pale face appeared. We said we were his guests and we could stay as long as we wanted. However, he also told us that we were all free to leave, not without consequences. Guarantee you didn't pick up consequences. Hey! Again, can't see that. Okay. <laughs> consequence? Oh shit! Yes! yes! You took over! Ah! <laughs> consequences, what do you mean? Right. Ah, the riddle. At first we'd like to there. Like... <laughs> okay! <laughs> but after some time, days, days begin to feel the same. Same conversations with the same people, nothing ever changed. That's because you're not really conversation. That's when our frustration started to show. I felt like our last effort together, we decided to solve the riddle. The place was slowly driving us mad. But it was too late for that. God was already there, we were stubborn to protect. It felt like a miracle that we were all still in the terms. It still does. You guys fucking ate each other! Wait, it was not a, it's all. <laughs> no, it's lore now. It's canon. We said it. I was like, this this would be a good story if this was true. <laughs> Besides, I'm not. <laughs> Besides, I'm not sure if any of us really wanted to leave for the unknown. Bye. He sounds like a girl now. Oh, bye. There you go. We don't know what is. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> we don't know what is beyond. It feels safe in here. But still, I think wouldn't have too hard. From my understanding, the meaning of it is. Oh, like any. Oh shit, the writer. Quite a story. Hey, you don't happen to have anything related to that riddle. Actually, I do have something. How oh, convenient, the person with the red hair who stands out among the crowd has something for us. Yeah. Not sure why you need it, but here, take it. Got something strange! Yay! Thank you, my name is Jacob, by the way. I posted you, right? It was nice chat, nice chatting, I have to be going now. Goodbye, Jacob. Come to my room. 206. Later tonight if you want to have some fun. You need the key though, find it. <laughs> <laughs> oh look, I can control the fucking angle of his head. Oh, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, this is a pointless feature that must be abused. Oh, oh no, it's like, ah. 
Oh, yes, yes, yes. Mm, yes, mm. yes, 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 I gotta fit in somehow. Mm, yes, yes, yes. Proper, proper. <laughs> Shit, Brian, it's you in the future. Hey, Red. Yes, yes. It reminds me mm. of, like, the Ryan statue from, like, Bioshock. Question mark. He must be crazy. And now I must see you move my head every time I talk. Hello there. Hello. 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 Oh, I'm yes, just a normal hello. man who just loves to shake his head from side to yes, side yes, every yes, so yes, often. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 yes. How are you? Hey. That's room number seven. Look, oh, a shiny shit. man with a guitar. That's awesome. Fuck you, shiny man. No, oh, go back to shiny man. Fuck you, shiny man. A dumb man, you are very shiny. But I don't care. I Nothing? just want your guitar. Oh, you can Okay. Oh, shit, he stopped playing. You want a Pepsi? Something you can do? <laughs> <laughs> I'll keep drinking until okay, he okay. starts talking. I can't push it to give this guy. Because he's a nerd! I don't know how to experience that. He's a fucking nerd! Yeah, but I don't know how to do talk like a nerd. They can do his voice either? Hello. Hey, wait. How did you know my name? <laughs> I don't know what the fuck. Okay. That's your feeling wet too. Oh, God damn it! <laughs> this is what I know. That's why I think of nerds. I'm feeling too wet today. Mm, Jacob. Oh, shit. I can't say I am. Who the hell are you? Don't you recognize me? Um, are you the guy that I see in the back alley next to a, van a white panel van with no markings? Nah, you will be correct. No, I have no memories of life for all this. Well, that's a good thing, my friend. Very good thing. But thank God I don't remember you. <laughs> you understand you are traumatized, yes? <laughs> well, I understood that the second I saw your face. I... Who are you? Jacob, I was your... Iconologist. I was fucking right. He's the guy in the panel van behind the behind the fucking office. That's his office. His office isn't the office. It's the thing behind the office. Yeah. And this is my workshop, you say. It's like I am your psychologist. It's yeah. like, like, um, where's your office? We are in my office. You're yeah, real cheap ass, you see. <laughs> uh, I had, I have a shrink. Why? You must understand, Jacob. You can know, only remember, begin after acceptance of how much of a cheapskate you are. But I can't give you that. I mean, you must take the journey. So much lies buried. Or ever imagined. Okay, I've run away. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, he's not scary, but because I'm giving this voice, you see, it's really scary. I mean, the, well, I mean, not only giving him the voice, but now he's a fucking psychologist, too. Yeah. What is this? Am I insane? Now, Jacob, you are far from insane. Yeah. I'm not too sure about that. I'm sitting here talking to him. We're pretty fucking insane. I, uh, I understand what it is it must feel like, but listen. They are ghosts. More mere lies. You s be more schizophrenic. <laughs> I sense you are not here today. Am I right? You got that right. I need to make sense in all this. Dick is the only way to feel your scars. I have will need already leave. Thanks. Thanks. Uh, oh. Uh, uh, it's, it's half a ham sandwich. <laughs> I wish I could help you more on your journey. You can! You literally said you could, you fuck! You just said you wouldn't! Actually, what did he give us? <laughs> Don't you just give me the rest of the shit now, you no. fuck? Gotta, gotta, it's supposed to be like your achieving thing. Fuck you! I really don't like Oh, is that as far as we can go? Yeah, it was. Well, shit. I'm all out of voices. Well, time to do it. Time to kill ourselves. What is this? Oh. Shit. Okay. Is this our inventory? Uh. <laughs> okay. I've tossed the ball. Sorry, I called you like that. I'm creepy, you see. That's okay. What did you have in mind? Oh. Is this like a deal going on now? <laughs> yeah, never mind. Say, have you noticed that red haired lady hanging around the lounge? I just had sex with her. Oh, shit. I don't think it hurt me. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. I just repeat it. Aw, oh, but it's not as funny the second time. Okay. <laughs> Let's get. 
Yeah, she's super hot. Yeah, I noticed her. Why? Well, it's a bit off, but I had sloppy seconds too. Oh. No. <laughs> After myself. What? <laughs> <laughs> well, call me again if you can spill it out. Oh. I fucking knew it. I. Sh I know. I'm gonna do that. I love her. Wow. Didn't hear me, but whatever. <laughs> I've, I've been wanting to talk to him, but I don't know how. Well, is it, he has clearly turned to 180. <laughs> you like that? Of course it does. Anytime anybody confesses love, they just become a little bitch. You look like a man that knows his way around women. Can you help me? Well, I don't consider myself a lady. Have in mind. Excellent. I want you to give me a date with her. Now, before you refuse, listen up. I have something. Something you'll need if you are ever going to leave this motel. Huh? Why do you use it? Me? Well, this place, this piece alone is not enough. Besides, this lovely lady. Fair enough. You mentioned I will need more than just one piece to get out. What was that all about? Well, so some kind of riddle. When you collect all the pieces to solve the riddle, I find I'm not sure enough. <laughs> the man with the red. Oh shit. I have the red tie told us that he said that we need all the pieces if we ever wanted to leave. Perfect. He added that we could. <laughs> oh, jeez, more text. <laughs> he added that we could stay as, as his guest, but as he mentioned, the twisted darkness would be false if we ever to leave. Dark riddle. There's no other way out. I'm afraid not. This is the only way. We once tried to solve the riddle with the residents of the motel, but that did not end well. Like I'm sure the red-haired lady told you, but everybody started eating each other. Huh. I don't get it. I mean, obviously does not want to give us a chance. Yes, I have been thinking about that. I think it's our damnation, but I don't really give a shit. I just care about the prostitute. Good look at it. <laughs> well, there is hope we push through. Hitting with... <laughs> While there is hope we push through, fighting the pain only to deceive ourselves. Without hope, all that is left. Only pain is... Let's uh, cut the case. What do you want me to do? I have written a letter to her, but there is something I want to include. I'm listening. A red rose. Classic. What can I, where could I find one? Hell yeah, that's, that's the fucking truck part, ain't it? Ah. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> that's the thing. I swear I saw a red rose somewhere, but you need to, you just need to look around. Okay, well, I'll, I'll get back to you once I've found it. Psycho. Thank you so much. Oh, please don't tell the red-haired woman of any of this. A loser? Here, I won't. Those of you at home are really scrunched together. It's super hot. And it's hot as hell no, that's, here. A, that's all I mean. It, yeah, it's super hot inside the room. Ah. <laughs> We're not actually showing it off. <laughs> oh! Then I can do it. No, that's not what I meant. I think it is. I'll see him. Delph. Overly complicated. Jacob takes an iron bar and starts sensibly bashing the same. <laughs> but to no avail. Do you plan on not guarantee, but do you plan on whole animations is just random shit going on to mess. Uh huh. I like those psychedelic things you see sometimes on YouTube. I wouldn't mind doing that, but like not just pure random shapes of thing you'd see like on media software. I am still really trying to figure this out. He says he hit it somewhere in this room. That's what. So like he says he hit it somewhere in here. He never specifically says yeah. this room. That's yeah, the he part doesn't that's say really annoying me. In here, but I just can't remember where. Okay, I'll start looking, you motherfucker. In here. Oh. Does he mean in the fuck oh, or in this fuck? Okay. Uh it's picking me up somehow. Oh right. Okay. Oh, wait, did that happen because we turned the light in the other area? No. But how what? Somewhere you just didn't go into yet? Okay. So God damn it. You annoying sound effect. 
<laughs> you know, party around, prop. No. Oh, old man who owns the motel, please. O only KY Jelly. This is where the. This is why everyone didn't solve the puzzle. They got annoyed by this. Can't handle it. <laughs> I wanted to see if like it would, the thing would change if I had like a certain piece equipped or something. No, no, it makes sense. You gotta use all the combinations in real life, huh? I mean, we could mess around with this and then see if anything changes inside the in just the environment. Has nothing. Her dick. Back up. It is hot. I am fucking sweating. Yeah, I can't believe you're even doing that. I used to be able to act of heat when summer came, but. Pussing out a lot this year. The only Undertale was fucking great. Was, yeah, was... you recently played Undertale. I did, yes. Finally, Jesus. I was really fucking avoiding that game. You and tried. It was really fucking hype. Oh yeah, that is true. I was really fucking. It was really fucking hyped, and I usually avoid those games because everyone just annoys me. Yeah, it's like the fans who over who overhype. Because, like, sure, there's recommendations, sure, like, this game is really good. I recommend it to you. There's the people. Ugh. It happened. It happens with other stuff. Like, I think one of the most notable ones was, like, Anime Death Note. Overhyped. Yeah, that. It's like. Yeah, I guess. I did not watch that for the longest time. Because I actually of it. watched it before the over overhyping happened. Right. Either you get there before the overhype or you're late. Yeah. And then you're just, like, suffocated by it. Yeah. I had actually watched it before that. So when the overhyping happened, I'm like, oh my god, you were all fucking annoying, and what are you talking Look, about? I get it, it's good. Stop! Yeah, <laughs> exactly, I'm like... Happens I mean, I hate so to be much. that guy, it's like, I watched Death Note before it was cool! <laughs> <laughs> all right, we are, we are all to blame for that. <laughs> in some way, like... <laughs> I showed you this anime, though. <laughs> <laughs> I was first! Make you be the cool one! Yeah, gee, seriously. And I, I can definitely see that for Undertale. Like, I, I'm lucky have like going there pretty early not the earliest by any margin yeah. but it's just like i luckily was able to go into the game i didn't know what the hell i was like and i'm glad oh uh, yeah by the time i got the undertale it was it was pretty much spoiled you know i knew yeah. kind of everything but it's still what i'm glad about is it still didn't remove the power of the story that's great like i i knew the characters I kind of knew what they were about, but overall, it didn't actually remove any of the story elements, and it was still a very enjoyable game to play. Like, they, you still got a better feel for the character's personality and shit. Right. So, that was... I, I was happy with it. Have we done, by the way? Huh? Have we, have we done nothing? We have literally accomplished nothing. Oh, fantastic. It's a fountain. <laughs> it is a fucking fountain, just like the last time we fucking saw it. Biggie. A big, a biggie. It's a biggie, biggie. <laughs> it's oh, a big, God. heavy, ring-shaped object. There you go. Bam. No. Not a ring. It's a ring-shaped mm. object. It's fucking ripe. Dang it, that's... You're stupid. Oh, okay. <laughs> have we? Yeah, we have, right? We've tried turning off the light and walk. Yeah, we, we've. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> off the light while he's in there. <laughs> I hate that shit so much. Ah. Like people, like does, I know I don't blame people. Reflexive, but like someone's leaving the room and they're like, "Boop, like, you dick." Ah. <laughs> uh, I gotta be in the kitchen trying to make something. You fucking turn off the light. I can't see shit. Cooking something. <laughs> Worst is when so when you're taking a shower and someone needs something from the bathroom. Matter right, because you're in the shower, but then they turn off the light. Gary, I don't mm. like being in the bathroom when. I actually don't mind. Because no. when uh, when uh, we actually changed out the circuit breaker in front of the part of the house, I was in the shower at the time. Oh really? I just took a fucking candle in there. 
<laughs> I know this is nice. Shower by candlelight. <laughs> well, time to take a bath. No. Yeah. Disgusting. Eh, could be take him. We're getting nowhere. We're making major progress. Cannot. Holy it's shit. Feet. Did something. What? Did something. Save. Just save. Progress has been made. <gasps> uh, what? It is. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Oh. We get it. Okay. Okay, we know what to do. We're getting somewhere, Brian. We're gonna save. <laughs> like you're something like I've already got insane. We're gonna save, and we know what to do. Okay. Okay. Took a while. I mean, no, it didn't take any time at all. We're fucking geniuses. Bam. Okay. You wish we were this fuck low. Yeah. Okay. That means we need to place this on and turn it to the right twice for the next one. Go check the right like, hand perhaps side. Perhaps maybe that turned off the counter. That's what I was thinking. Nope. No, you can hear, hear it. That shit. But it sounds. No, it's the same. Yeah. It's about it. Can't take a little juke out of it. Oh, this this water was not clean. Oh, right. Shit, that's the fucking. <laughs> <laughs> That's a fucking balcony, shit. Right, uh, so nothing, 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 nothing. Okay, so that did something, save. Uh, <laughs> okay. Uh. I don't push oh. yeah, I want you to just do like a Assassin's Creed. Just right on my way. Right on my way. <laughs> That's a bully. Nothing's changed in here. At all. Oh my god. And clearly that was something. Do we need three other round, big, heavy, ring-shaped objects? I surely hope not. That'd be dick. Sorry, man. What are you... Yes. Uh, oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, just keep telling your bum to yourself that no one else is listening. Besides their psychologist. He won't talk to me anymore. Oh, really? Yeah. I'm, igno I'm ignoring you now. Uh. I won't even listen to your issues. I'm a great psychologist, you see. Oh. Uh, get the fuck out of my way, yeah. miss. No, I don't- get your short hair out of here. You're confusing me. <laughs> A trap. Crap. Oh, why did you do that? There's nothing up. Oh. <laughs> As far as we can go today. Huh? Yeah. You actually want to feel like you accomplished something? Yeah. I feel you. I feel you. So we've only been here for like about an hour and about the same mentality as everyone else. It's time to eat people. So I can't the most part of the story. <laughs> yeah, I know, that's lore. <laughs> it's like, yeah, my head cannon, yeah, you're totally right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> mm. Hey, Brian. Yeah, hey, what's up? Let's stop. Okay, fine. I'll have to pick this up next time when we actually do some. <laughs> <laughs> I must close my bit more. <laughs> I blame you. Oh god. <laughs> Thanks for that. Oh, you're very welcome. I always like to uh, enlighten people's lives with more humor. Mm hmm. Oh, I, I just kind of assumed you were trying to kill me. <clears throat> Damn, Dylan, you just turned me off. I don't know how I'd feel about that. 